Okay guys, so in tonight's video we're going to have a quick look at how to check and fix your Bamboo Lab A1 or A1 Mini extruder where the nozzle has become loose and you'll normally notice that it's it'll show up first as a first layer or bad first layer where it's just not calibrating um, the nozzle height off the bed correctly and that's because as the nozzle comes down it's loose so it's pushing the nozzle up I suppose not getting an accurate measurement and then when it starts to print the filament itself is being forced down into the nozzle pushing the nozzle down which means that that 0.2 of a millimeter that it had allowed for the first layer is now non-existent so it's basically dragging the nozzle on the bed um, it's a very easy fix and it's very common because loads of people are complaining about it so what you want to do is pop your cover off if you have nails it doesn't help when you don't you get your silicone sock and remove it just catch it and pull it off and down this one has seen better days and needs to be replaced catch your little clip and catch your nozzle and remove it just make sure you cut your filament first catch this and lift it out to one side you'll see in here there are three screws i'm just going to zoom in slightly these three screws are what holds the heater plate to the extruder. These are a regular two mil Allen key, I think. Once you those three out, just shake them and it'll pop out. Put them on side. Now you need to be careful when you're pulling this down because your heater cables and your thermistor cables are on the back of it. So you can see there, there are four screws. I'm just going to adjust the camera ever so slightly. see there the four screws that hold the heater block to this little plate and these are the ones that come loose and when they're loose your nozzle can't calibrate correctly now, I've already checked this one and it's fine but I'm just going to show you they're normally just like this partly tight they're not fully tight so get your allen key and just make sure each of these is snug don't over tighten it because it's going into aluminium but tight enough I've actually put thread lock on these just to make sure that they don't come loose again because I had this done earlier on and I did two prints but the heating and contracting with the printing seems to have uh, loosened them up again so I suggest if you are doing it use a tiny little dab of thread lock on each of them just to make sure they don't come loose once you have the four of them tight simply reverse of what you've just done Turn this back into position without damaging your cables. Line it up, tighten your screws. These have thread lock on them from the factory, but the other four don't. So once you have it, you're reasonably happy that they're tight, just snug them down the rest of the way. Reinsert the nozzle back into the machine. Close up with the clip and refit your silicone sock. Put 
cover back on and you're going to want to run calibration on this once you've that done just to make sure that everything is as expected but it should mean that you are now getting a perfect first layer once it has calibrated the nozzle height all right so give it a try any issues let me know in the comments and i'll try and talk you through it okay thank you